Question number 10. A tourist converted 5,820 US dollars into Kenyan shillings at the rate of 102.10 Kenyan shillings per dollar. While in Kenya, he spent 450,000 Kenyan shillings and converted the balance into US dollars at the rate of 103.00 Kenyan shillings per dollar. We are expected to calculate the amount of money to the nearest dollar that remained. So the first rate was 0 0.2 Kenyan shillings being equal to 1 US dollar. So we ask ourselves what about 5,820 US dollars by cross multiplication will have 102.1 here there is a point 0.1 multiplied by 5,820 US dollars divided by 1 so if you multiply 102.1 by 5,820, you will get 594,222 Kenyan shillings. We are also told that while in Kenya, he spent 450,000 Kenyan shillings. So we subtract the amount of money he spent in Kenya. So we have four five hundred and ninety four two hundred and twenty two we less four hundred and fifty thousand and this gives us one hundred and forty four thousand two hundred and twenty two Kenyan shillings. We are expected to change this back to US dollar at the rate 103 Kenyan shillings per dollar so we have 144,222 Kenyan shillings to convert to US dollar and the rate is 103 Kenyan shillings for 1 US dollar Again, we cross multiply. We'll have 144,222 multiplied by 1 US dollar divided by 103. And this gives us 1,400.2 US dollars. But we are told to calculate to the nearest US dollar. So this becomes 1,400 US dollars.